if you're rocking this new Galaxy S25 Ultra or Plus and want to keep your photos, videos, documents, and even apps extra secure, we're diving into the setup process of Samsung's built-in secure folder. Let's go ahead and see how to create and use it. For that, we need to first open up settings. Now to set up a secure folder, you need to just log in with your Samsung account. It could be a separate Samsung account or you can log in with your Google account, whatever you are using. So from settings, go to secure and privacy, scroll down for more security settings and then to secure folder. Just go through this initial setup process by pressing continue. Wait patiently when the secure folder is being created. Now for your secure folder, you gotta create a pin, password, pattern, or even a fingerprint, whatever you are comfortable with. And to recover all your data in case you forgot your password, you can enable the allow lock reset with Samsung account option, and then just press next. This is your secure folder. If you tap on this plus sign, from this list of all your apps, you can add those apps that will appear only on your secure folder. You can download any app from Play Store or Galaxy Store to directly download into your secure folder. And for this purpose, you need to log into Play Store once again. From this three dot menu to add files, you can also add different types of files like image, video, audio, documents, or straight from the My File or internal storage as well. We have a separate video, how to hide your photos and videos on your secure folder. If you want, you can check that out. So once again, from this three dot, in customize section, you can customize the secure folder's name, color, and icon just to make it hidden in plain sight. And lastly, from this three dot menu to settings again, first of all, you can customize the auto lock secure folder frequency. And also, if you wanna hide it from your app screen, you can toggle off this option and then tap on hide. Your secure folder will be absolutely hidden from anywhere in your app screen or home screen. To access that folder, you will have to go back to the same settings where you've created your secure folder. And then you gotta enter your PIN or password. After entering this PIN or password, you will have to just re-enable this option. Then you gotta re-enter your secure folder. And this is pretty much how you can set up and use your secure folder. Thanks for watching.